Welcome to Star Technology 5G. In the last video, we studied up and down counter using PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. In today video I will show you multiplexing with 7 segments display using PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Let's start the video. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G and click on the bell icon. Multiplexing In 7 segments display multiplexing segments of all the digits are tied together and the common pins of each digit are turned on separately by the microcontroller. When each digit is displayed only for several milliseconds, the eye cannot tell that the digits are not on all the time. You can see in the figure. Here is digit 1 and here is digit 2. All segments of digit 1 are tied with digit 2 segments. Segment A Segment B Segment C Segment D Segment E Segment F Segment G And common pin of each digit are turned on separately by the microcontroller. For example, to display the number 12, we have to send 1 to the first digit and enable its common pin. After a few milliseconds, number 2 is sent to the second digit and the common point of the second digit is enabled. When this process is repeated continuously, it appears to the user that both displays are on continuously. You can see in the figure. If we want to display 12 on 7 segments display, first we have to send number 1 to the first digit and enable its common pin and disable digit 2 common pin. After a few milliseconds, number 2 is sent to the second digit and the common point of the second digit is enabled and disable digit 1 common pin. When this process is repeated continuously, it appears to the user that both displays are on continuously. Project, Multiplexing with 7 Segments Display The 7 segments display are connected to port C of a PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Segments A to G of the display are connected to the microcontroller through 190 ohm current limiting resistors and the microcontroller operated from an 8 MHz crystal. Each digit is enabled using a BC108 type transistor connected to pins RD6 and RD7 of the microcontroller. Here is the circuit diagram we are using in our project. It is PIC 16 F877 microcontroller. Pin number 1 is master reset. If we press the switch it will reset the microcontroller. Port C is interfaced with 7 segment display and we are using common anode type 7 segment display. All segments are connected with microcontroller through a current limiting resistor, and the value of the resistors is 190 ohm. And pin RD6 and RD7 are connected with common pins of 7 segments display through BC108 transistors. The value of the resistor is 1 kilo ohm. Pin numbers 13 and 14 are the interface with an 8 MHz crystal and 22 PF capacitors are connected with the crystal. Pin number 11 and 32 are connected with positive 5 volts. Pin number 12 and 31 are connected with ground volt. Let draw this circuit in Proteus.
the circuit is ready now we will write its code in micro CPIC. Here is the window where we can write the code. I already wrote the code otherwise video gets very long. I will copy the code. And I will pass it here. Now I will define you the code. S bit. This one, at port D. B6. Define display 1, at port D pin RD6. S bit. This 2, at port D. B7. Define display 2, at port D pin RD7. Unsigned char code 10. This line defined data type char array named code and it has total 10 elements. 0x79, 0x24, 0x30, 0x19, 0x12, 0x02, 0x78, 0x00, 0x10, and 0x40. Unsigned char. Deck. Dig. Del. Define variable. Void ms delay. Unsigned char time. Here is function of delay with variable name time. Unsigned char y, z. Define variable named y and z. For loop. y equals zero. y less than time. And increment y. z equals zero. Z less than 254. And increment Z. We are using for loop as delay. Void main. Main function. Main code start from here. TRISC equals 0x00. Set port C as output port. TRISD. RD6 equals 0. Set port D pin RD6 as output pin. TRISD. RD7 equals 0. Set port D pin RD7 as output pin. This 1 equals 0, turn off display 1. This 2 equals 0, turn off display 2. While 1, endless loop. For deck equals 0, deck less than 10, and increment the deck. We used this for loop for display decimal number. For dig equals 0, dig less than 10, and increment the dig. We use this for loop for display digit number. For del equals 0, del less than 10, and increment the del. We use this for loop for creating delay between next digits. This one equals 1. Turn on display 1. Port C equals code. Deck. This line find code from array and send that data to port C. This line display initial value of deck. The initial value of deck is 0. It will send 0 to port C. MS delay 10. Call delay. This delay decide how long we want to turn on the display 1. This 1 equals 0. And turn off display 1. Next we will display the digit. This 2 equals 1. Turn on display 2. Port C equals code. Dig. This line find code from array and send that data to port C. This line display initial value of dig. The initial value of dig is 0. It will send 0 to port C. MS delay 10. Call delay. This delay decide how long we want to turn on the display 2. This 2 equals 0. And turn off display first we display decimal second we will display digit. Del for loop will repeat 10 times. It will decide how long we want to display the characters on the 7 segments display. After completing 10 cycle it will get exit from del for loop. Next dig for loop increment the value of dig and display 1 on 7 segment display. Now again del for loop will repeat 10 times. After completing 10 cycle it will get exit from loop and dig for loop again increment the value of dig. And after completing 10 cycle of dig for loop it will get exit from loop. 
This time deck for loop increment the value of deck now the value of deck is 1 it will display on the 7 segment display and again for loop start repeating the cycles. This process repeat again and again so the I cannot tell that the digits are not on all the time. Now we will create the hex file. Just click on the build icon. Finished successfully. File is created now we will load hex file into the microcontroller. Double click on the microcontroller. Select the hex file. OK. And click on the run simulation. You can see it will start counting. If you have any problem with the code let me know in comments. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the Star Technology 5G. And keep watching Star Technology 5G.